In this video, we're going to look at percentage increase and decrease. Uh, so in order to do this, I'm going to work through two examples just to show you the process. If we want to increase £350 by 5%, then what we need to do is work out what the 5% of the £350 was in the first place, and then add it on, increase it. So, we need to work out what 5% is, so we can work out what 10% is by dividing by 10, and then halve that to work out what 5% is. So 5% is half of £35, which is £17.50. So, to increase £350 by 5%, I must add the £350 to the extra 5%, the £17.50. So we get 5, 7, 6, 3, so 367 pound 50, okay? And that's how we can calculate it. In the second example, we're going to do a decrease, so we're decreasing 610, by, 610 pounds by 25%. So we're going to calculate 25% and subtract that from the original 610. So, in order to work out 25%, I'm going to work out what 50% is. It's £305. So half of that is 25%, which is £152.50. So you could do that in a number of different ways to find the actual percentage. You can use a calculator if you like. Okay, but things like 25%, you should be able to do those by hand. So we're going to take the £610 and subtract £152.50. So we've got 0, take away 0, 0. 0, take away 5, I can't do, so I'm going to have to borrow. 10, take away 5 is 5. 9 take away 2 is 7, 0 take away 5 I can't do, so 10 take away 5 is 5, 5 take away 1 is 4. So decreasing £610 by 25% I get £457.50. So this is how you do an increase by a percentage and a decrease. And in the next video I'm going to show you how you can do it quickly using a calculator.